What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel. So we're going to do a continuation of our NASCAR Heat 5 career mode with episode 13. But first we're going to pack in a hogger. We're at Texas today. Now, crazy, crazy term of events. We did not qualify in last. That's a little wild. But we, we qualified P31. Not exactly sure where we're going to be starting. Texas Motor Speedway. Looks like we're starting P30. So our goal position is P30. Once again, like I've said in the last upload, which I feel like it's been like a week since I've actually recorded part of our career because I've been doing a lot of the throwback paint schemes, which I want you guys to drop a comment down below what you guys think of that. If you guys have not seen them yet, do me a favor, go check that playlist. Um, I'm going to try potentially to have a new paint scheme every day for a short period of time. Um, eventually you're going to run out of paint schemes to be able to replicate and, uh, we'll get to that route when we get there. But for the time being, I'm enjoying doing that type of stuff. So if you guys can go ahead and show the support on those videos as well, that would be freaking awesome. Uh, today is Friday and, uh, tomorrow we're actually going to be doing kind of an older style hands-on video, which I'm excited for. And, uh, continuing making the content like we have been talking about for freaking ever. So we dropped back to the P32. That shit didn't take freaking long. But as stated in the previous episodes, I'm not looking to run all that great. I'm just looking to run clean, not piss anybody off, make a, you know, a decent amount of money within the next couple races, and uh, truthfully, upgrade, and then maybe even in this episode yet, or in an upcoming episode, us start to compete. Um, some of these races, you guys might notice, I might actually be a few races of he ahead of what the last race was. Um, that is going to be solely due to the fact that I'm not going to record some of the stuff. I'm not going to record every single race of me coming P32 with this obviously being our first race back, a little bit rusty. We're, we're just going to get a feel for it. So we might, you know, just kind of touch base a few races down the road um, with a lot more upgrades, though, hopefully. Uh, that would be the key there. So after this race, most likely we're going to come in P32. There's going to be probably a considerable jump between this race and the next race you guys physically see, even in this episode. Um, just overall, you know, time gap, which is completely okay. But, man, it has been a crazy week. I don't know about you guys. I'm glad it's Friday. It has been a crazy week, and unfortunately... A lot of my videos that like even the videos that you guys get during the week um, are, are, are recorded on the weekend like between Friday Saturday Sunday um, I try to knock out as many videos as I as I can that is good videos um, like for example continuing this career um, you know using one day to just knock out and edit a couple different actual episodes um, so right now it is shit. It is 7:44 Friday night. Um, this video will probably be kind of like a 9, 10 o'clock release tonight. Um, by the time that I edit everything and get it up and, and ready to go, um, but this would actually be the third video that I have recorded already before midnight on Friday, which is crazy. Uh, the Elliot Sadler video is up. I actually did that when I got off of work. Hey, we're not going to come in last. Look at that. Some excitement for you guys in this video. Um, I actually recorded that when I got home, quickly edited, um, and actually made another video, edited that one, and now we're in this. That's why you guys will notice in the Elliot Sadler video, I'm wearing this in the video that's coming here in a couple hours for you guys because I'm recording it literally right now. Um, I'll be wearing this and then also in tomorrow morning's upload, I will be wearing this. So over the weekend, we're going to try to have two uploads a day. I can't guarantee that that'll be like that every single day of the week, but I'm hoping to do two uploads a day on Saturdays and Sundays, potentially even Fridays, depending on what is going on, what my schedule looks like and different things along those lines. So cool thing is we're not coming in last, you know, that's, that's solid. Um, unless the truck that blew up behind us is, you know, somehow magically going to catch us. Uh, we're not going to come in last, which is going to be good because we ran a clean race as we get ready to come up to lap nine here in a couple seconds. Yeah, you go get mommy and Bobby. 
Um, you know, ba basically, just kind of stockpiling the money. Looks like that truck's in the pits, so we are pretty much go or guaranteed to not come in last, which is freaking phenomenal. Um, a lot of this stuff, I've said it before. Some of you are into the NASCAR content. Some of you are not into the NASCAR content. Regardless of the fact, it is going to be a part of my channel. Um, whether people like it, whether people don't like it, it's me, you know, and ultimately when you think of the name Snussy Copen, and I personally think about the name Snussy Copen, and it's a name that I've carried for, uh, you know, like seven or eight years now. Um, basically I want my channel to be doing things that I like, and it might not necessarily be things that you guys like, but I genuinely enjoy playing NASCAR. I genuinely enjoy some of the other stuff, you know, that we do obviously as well. Uh, we have a 17% front right tire with one lap to go. So hopefully it does not blow. And we have a rehash of the last freaking episode where we did end up blowing a freaking tire, which kind of caught me off guard. But let's see if we can have this 13%. There we go. Perfect. All right, guys, let's head to the next friggin' race. Well, if you fast forward a couple weeks or three quarters of the season, um, we're at Bristol starting P22. We have an 88, 85, 80 truck here. We've had a couple good runs where we ran actually in the teens, and uh, I figured Bristol would be a good race to kind of jump in and show you guys because we, we've been somewhat clean running. So I figured we can we can afford to be a little bit dirty here today at Bristol, right? Am I right? Am I right? So we can we can just push our way up there. We can do the do. Let's see here. Bob Gillen, my friend. Fuck you. P19. Let's see if we can crack out a top 15 here today. Who thinks we can do it? I, I mean, I, I genuinely, I don't know. I think in this upload, we're going to wrap out our first truck series season. And uh, we definitely made some headway. Didn't want to bore you guys to death because there was like 10 races where, you know, it wasn't all that exciting. Yeah, we had a couple runs where we finished, you know, mid-pack. And that's that's great. It brought in a lot of money. We just got booted, man. Totally just got booted. But... That is completely okay. I think I'm going to show you guys also one or two more races in this episode. I'm not entirely sure just yet. This might be the last one. I'm not I'm not entirely sure. I guess I guess we'll just see where time takes us. Boy, that was really stupid, man. Just letting you know that was really dumb. So now I'm going to chop down on you, dumbass. But truthfully, as we get ready to head into our second season in the truck series, this is where the content on this is going to be very, very interesting because it's going to be weekend or weekend, week out, driving pretty hard, running for contention, and it is going to be a freaking blast. Uh, right now we have our caps set at 90 engine, 85 suspension, I believe, and 80 aero, and uh, we're looking to upgrade that before the end of the season here. So everything that we do within the next couple weeks before the season ends is just going to do nothing but help us for next season. And uh, we didn't have any hot seats. So it's it's a good thing that, you know, I didn't record all this stuff because who knows, we would have continued this on for like three or four more episodes. But instead, I chopped it down to where you guys are only going to get to see kind of the positive stuff now. I know we had a pretty nasty time in the Extreme Dirt Tour series. We are still yet to get our first career win. Uh, part of the reason that I wanted to race at Bristol was I was kind of hoping, like, I don't know, maybe maybe we would get lucky and have a decent enough truck to be able to compete. And, uh, you know, honestly, even P21 right now is better than coming in P31, which is what you guys have really seen from my channel in the truck series. So, you know, jumping up 10 spots and, you know, running, not mid-pack, but definitely not in the rear, um, you know, it's a lot. it's a lot better. It, you know, and, and we're truthfully going to do nothing but get higher and higher and higher. And as we enter into our next season in the truck series for the next episode, we are going to be a contender, like a genuine contender. And uh, we're going to get some hot seats and different stuff like that. And it's going to be so much more exciting And coming in P32, P31 because somebody blew up. Ooh, we might be able, we've got 
three laps to go, two and a half laps to go, we might, might be able to sneak our way into the top 20. Maybe. If we can get underneath Boyd within the next two laps, we could potentially make that happen. I went a little bit too low there. You guys can bitch me in the comments down below. That's fine. Whoa, Boyd, you did the same squirrely shit that you did before, man. And not now you're getting stupid loose. What a dipshit. Sorry, Harmon, but I'm sliding up the track. Harmon, we're taking that P20, man. I'm sorry. I have to. I have to. We need to show everybody that we are P20 in better material, even though we're, we're going to come in, in P20. Maybe we can get on Nima check. Rattles cage. Nope. P20. Wow, that really froze. And by the way, my wheels are still freaking green. So, um, yeah, they didn't fix that or the glitching at the very end. But let's see where the next race that I'm going to show you guys is going to be at. I couldn't just not show you guys Talladega. So we're going to do it today. Not the best truck that we could have. But I'm hoping we can get a hold of the draft here and move forward. Not sure how many laps it is. I'm, I'm assuming seven. Seven laps. Let's see what we can do. See if we can slowly push our way towards the front. There's only a couple races left in the season. I think there's only two more after this. See if we can't get a good run here today. Honestly, if, if we can get better than a top 20, I would be... Everybody's checking up. Why the hell is everybody checking up? Way to just destroy my run, you mush fucks. P26. We're climbing. Getting a bump from Harmon in the back. In that case, you better stay the hell out of my way. Solder, don't even think about it. Uh, don't push us below that yellow line. Thank you. Holy hell, we're moving. First lap and we're already in P18. Look at that. Deep breaths. We don't have a great truck, but we are utilizing the draft pretty fantastically. That's even a damn word. Whoever that is, he's all by himself. So maybe we can push our way up towards him. Holy hell, we're running in 12th. We are running in 12th, guys. We might experience the top 10 for the first time in our truck series career. Holy shit. Problem is, with this, I think we can get ourselves possibly up front. I don't, I'm not bullshitting you on that. I think we could possibly get ourselves up front, but I don't want to do it too soon because if we do it too soon we're gonna get fucking ran over we're i mean we're just gonna get annihilated but there we are we're running in the top 10 baby that is a great feeling what a freaking fantastic feeling running in p7 who would have thought you know what we just jump back to p9 that's all right we'll get p7 back here on the turn give me a little push baby give me a little push good stuff they're going to be left out here all alone unless White wants to jump out. Back into P7. Bumping and grinding. Let's see if we can maybe get him to bite to go up top. Nope. Somebody jump up top. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to take advantage of that. We're going to take, hopefully, two spots. Effinger, you dick. Can we touch the top five? I'm going to cry. running p5 let's shoot outside try to get a draft try to get a run oh whoa whoa what are we doing here we need to get back down though we need to get back down fuck you i think fuck you fuck you all right you know what you can have it because guess what i'm gonna get you bitch i'm gonna get you bitch you watch We're gonna get help from behind and you're gonna get butt fucked by the engine. Dude, why is everybody jumping around like that? Holy shit. 
Alright, adrenaline's pumping. Three to go. I need somebody to work with me here. Why are you going all the way up there? Dude, had you worked with me, we would have had something going. I swear, if Effinger wins this race, I'm going to be pissed. And I'm not going to help him. I'll wreck him before I have him win this damn race. Don't you dare try to slide down. Smart move. Smart move. I am just so stoked to be running up in the front. Come on. Come on. Two laps to go. I might push Effinger if it comes to that. To try to make a move. But I don't think we're going to have a chance. If we do have a chance to make our move. It is going to be on the last lap. Hands down. Going to be on the last lap. Smith. Ah, Effinger you dickhead. This is our only hope. We got a sender. Whoa. I have no idea what just happened there, but we're getting one hell of a push. Let's go. Let's go. Are we going to make it on fuel? Yeah, we're going to make it. Give us a push like that again. Come on. Come on. Whew. Fuck you on stand down low. We're going to get you in three. Come on, give me a push. Give me a push. Come on. Come on. Somebody's got to roll with me. Somebody's got to roll with me. I might have fucked myself. Come on. Ah, fuck. I fucked myself going in that little lane. Effinger is still going to win this fucking race. Damn. Let's get a top three. Come on, get a run out of four. Get a run out of four. Come on. You know what? I ain't even mad. Because I'm going to get you, bitch. You wait. Season number two, I'm coming for you. Key three. Woo, baby. All right. Guys, I'm going to finish out the rest of the season. In the next upload, you guys are going to see the new paint scheme that we're going to be running in our second season. That is a great feeling to get our first top five finish in the truck series. I'll catch you guys in the freaking next one. Make sure you subscribe to the damn channel. Join us on our journey to 10,000 subscribers. I'm gonna edit this quick so you guys can see it here. Hopefully in the next 30 minutes. I'll see ya.